It is sure an amazing feeling to attain the height of a billionaire and be successful at a very young age. On this note, I will be showing you in today's video 11 young billionaires in Nigeria. Habi FX Damilari Ogundari, popularly known as Habi FX, was born on the 18th of March 2001 and hails from Oshun State in the southwestern part of Nigeria. He's a Nigerian entrepreneur and an author. Damilari is a philanthropist and has helped many youths achieve their goals. Aside from business, Damilari is a philanthropist who has helped many young people achieve their dream. Regardless of how much of an impact Damilari has had in assisting Nigerian youths in developing their knowledge of forex trading, he does not intend to stop there. Among other mind-blowing achievements which Damilari has, Damilari is known to have made his first 1 million naira at the age of 18. He's more passionate in impacting other people and have created a series of young millionaires over the years. He also wrote a book to show you how dedicated he is to succeeding. Damilari owns a well-furnished mansion at Oshobo, the capital of Oshun State, and being a lover of luxurious cars, he has to his name several cars which include a Porsche, a Range Rover Vela, a Lexus IS350, a Mercedes-Benz CLA45, and several more. His net worth is placed at $9 million. B-Lord. The Bitcoin Lord, Linus William Ifejika, was born on the 14th of March 1999 in Umuji Ebenebe, Oka North Oka Government, Anambra State. Of the seven children of his family, Linus happens to be the first son of the family. According to a post he shared on Instagram some time ago, B-Lord left his parents' house at the age of 17 to pursue his dreams, became a millionaire at the age of 20, got married at the age of 21, and had his first child at the age of 22. B-Lord has been working long enough in the cryptocurrency industry, and over the years of his operation, he has built and gained solid reputation for his entrepreneurial skill and an in-depth understanding understanding of the complexity surrounding the Bitcoin industry, which has made him very wealthy and also own a few companies like the b -Lord Group of Companies, the b -Lord Automobiles and others. His net worth is estimated to be $10 million and he, and he owns a fully taste furnished mansion in Alka. Also, he is a lover of supercars and as such own a Mercedes-Benz GLE 450, a Mercedes-Benz G63 and a Toyota Helios just to mention a few. Kubana Chief Priest. Kubana Chief Priest, as is popularly known, is a businessman, a show promoter, a philanthropist, and the owner of the popular club Shrine that's situated in Owere, Imo State. His full name is Pascal Chibuke Okechuku and is from Imo State, Nigeria. Kubana Chief Priest is a native of Umuhu Okabia in Olu local government area of Imo State, Nigeria. He was born on the 2nd of April 1981 in his hometown. His first trade was making shoes, which he learned when he joined his father in Aba, Abia State. This goes a long way to tell you that the Aba and shoes have been very close since time immemorial. According to him, he made his first one million naira from shoemaking during his school days in Federal Polytechnic in Ekede in Imo State. In his car garage are a Rolls Royce Phantom, a Rolls Royce Cullinan, a Toyota Hilux, a Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon, a Geely Courier, and several other cars. His net worth is estimated to be $17 million, and he owns a nice apartment in Imo State and in Lekki, Lagos State. Linda Ikeji. On September 19, 1918, in Imo State, Nigeria, a prominent figure in the Nigerian media named Linda Ikeji was born into a devoted Catholic family of six siblings. When she was 10 years, she developed a keen interest in writing and did exceptionally well in school. Linda received her degree from the University of Lagos in 2004, and by the year 2006, she had grown passionate about her hobby of blogging. She had to post at the cyber cafe because internet access was not, not yet as widespread in Nigeria at that time. She is now a well-known blogger, author, businesswoman, and former model in Nigeria. She has amassed wealth as one of Africa's richest bloggers. And other sources where she generates her revenue from her side blogging also include owning a TV station, a standard YouTube channel, and several other sources. The blogger owns an excellent home in Lagos and her hometown. She also has to her car collection a Range Rover Sport, a Mercedes, a Bentley, and several cars. Her net worth is estimated to be $19 million. Bonner Boy. Bonner Boy's career can be likened to a spark becoming a flame that burns with the intensity of a true artist. Born Damini Ebon Luwogulu, Bonner Boy spent his early years in Nigeria. He honed his musical talent here and absorbed the cultural richness that would later influence his music. Bonner Boy's entrance into the music scene was anything but timid. With a fusion of reggae, dancehall, and Afrobeat, he created his own brand of music. This gained him fame with tracks like Ye from the third studio album Outside. His efforts were also recognized globally with his fourth album, African Giant. This acclaimed work nominated for a Grammy and highlighted his broadening appeal. It also established him to an international force in the music industry. Bonaboy then took the torch and ran with it, further solidifying his prominence with his Grammy-winning album, Twice as Tall, a year later. The Grammy winner's net worth is placed at $22 million, making him one of the youngest billionaires in Nigeria. The singer also owned an amazingly furnished mansion in Lekki, Lagos State, and in his car garage are a Ferrari GTS 812, a Lamborghini Urus, a Range Rover autobiography, and a Rolls Royce down convertible, just to mention a few. Siji Bomi Ogundele. Siji Bomi was born on April 8, 1981, into a home with a father who worked a 9 to 5 job as a manager and a mother who was a full time entrepreneur. As most who had a smooth start to their career quest, Siji Bomi did not exactly have it that way. Before venturing into real estate business, he first started a bike business from his savings. Despite his parents' disapproval, he drew his inspiration from his mother's entrepreneurial spirit and grew his bike business from one to six motorcycles. Although being a lawyer in 2004, he started his career in risk assessment, where he moved up to lending in SMEs and set up Moto Finance in Paris, which later 
branched out to Accra, Dubai, Madrid, and New York City. Subsequently, his interest in the real estate business also grew while he was in South France as a real estate agent in 2011. His first kick was buying an apartment, remodeling it, and reselling it for double the price. This piqued his interest in the real estate business. After that, he leaped into the Nigerian real estate industry, risk management, and project management. In 2013, he founded the company Sojimoto in partnership with the real estate mogul, Mr. Yasid Al Haraji. Being the sixth youngest billionaire in Nigeria, he owns to his name a Toyota Land Cruiser, a Rolls Royce Phantom, and several other supercars. He also owns several mansions across Nigeria, being a real estate mogul, and he has a net worth of $25 million. Whiskey. Ayodeji Ibrahim Balogun, popularly known by his stage name Whiskey, is a Nigerian singer and songwriter. He began recording music at the age of 11. He managed to release a collaborative album with the Glorious Five, a group he and a couple of his church friends formed. Whiskey is one of the most successful Nigerian artists of all time. His net worth is estimated to be around $30 million, making him one of the wealthiest African musicians. His primary source of income is music sales and performance, but he also has numerous endorsement deals with major brands. In Whiskey's garage are a Lamborghini Urus, a Rolls Royce Cullinan, a Mercedes Maybach van, and several more. The singer has a house in Lekki and with Larry of Lagos and another in Los Angeles. On the video. David Adedeji Adeleke, who is better known as The Video, is an American-born Nigerian singer, songwriter, and record producer. The Video was born in Atlanta, U.S., and raised in Lagos. He made his music debut as a member of the music group KB International. His 2011 single, Damiduro, was well-received throughout Nigeria. The singer went to British International School Lagos, after which he got admission to study business administration at Oakwood University, which he later dropped out of to focus on music, but later went back to school and got a degree in music from Bangkok University in Nigeria. This awesome singer was recently denied a Grammy Award after being nominated in three different category can sure not be left out on the list of young billionaires in Nigeria, as he has an astonishing net worth of $45 million. The singer is also a lover of cars and as such has so many to his name. A few in his collection includes a Maybach S680, a Lamborghini Aventador, a Rolls Royce Cullinan, a private jet, and several other luxurious cars. He also owns an amazing home in Atlanta, Georgia, USA, and another in Banana Island, Lagos. Number 3, Obi Kubana. Obi Naiyegu, popularly known as Obi Kubana, is a Nigerian-based businessman, entertainer, entrepreneur, philanthropist, and a show killer. He's the chairman and owner of the popular Kubana group. Obi Kubana was born on the 12th of April, 1975, and he hails from Oba, a community in Demili South local government area in Anambra State, Nigeria. As the third youngest billionaire in Nigeria, Obi Kubana juggled several businesses to have attained such a height. A few of such businesses include Rolex Hotels Lagos, Grand Kubana Hotel Abuja, Opium Kubana Oweri, and several more. He has an estimated net worth of $96 million. Just like every other wealthy person, Obi Kubana is also a lover of car, and as such, owns a Mercedes-Benz Formatic S450, two Lexus LS570, a Mercedes-Benz S50, and many more. He owns a well-furnished mansion in Abuja and another in his hometown. If you know you're the next in line to become a billionaire, type it is my turn to shine in the comment section. Joey Zaza. Joseph Eze Okafor, for popularly known as Joey Zaza, was born on the 19th March 1985. He's a popular Nigerian billionaire, entrepreneur, and philanthropist. He's the founder and CEO of Jesco Oil, an oil and gas company that operates in Nigeria and other African countries. Joey Zaza is known for his luxurious lifestyle and his philanthropic efforts, which include donating to various charitable causes in Nigeria. He's one of the money bags in Nigeria, and he's worth hundreds of billions of naira. Joey Zaza has been living his life on a low key, and people don't really know much about him. He drives a lot of exotic cars, both within and outside the country. Joey Zaza's net worth is estimated to be $100 million. In his car collection are a Rolls Royce Cullinan, a private jet, a Lamborghini Aventido, a slingshot, a G-Wagon, and many more. He also has several houses across Nigeria. E-Money. Emeka Okonkwo, popularly known as E-Money or Arab Money, is a very popular billionaire in the country's social media space. He has so many streams of income and they include entertainment, shipping, amongst other businesses. Emeka Okonkwo was born in Ajegunle, Lagos on the 18th day of February 1981. This shows that no matter your background, you can still make it real big. The billionaire owns a chain of businesses which include being the CEO of Emi Cargo's Nigeria, Five Star Music, he's also into real estate, oil and gas. Being the youngest and wealthiest billionaire in Nigeria, E-Money has an awesome net worth of $120 million and in his car garage are a Rolls Royce fan Tom, a private jet, a Cadillac Escalade, a Mercedes-Benz Sprinter bus, and the Don has a house in Lagos, his hometown, and cities across the country. If you've enjoyed this video, do well to hit the like button, click on the bell icon to get notified when next we drop a new video.